So I wanted to take a moment uh, to get on camera and talk about uh, this major landmark decision by the Supreme Court uh, granting marriage equality uh, throughout the entire United States. And the fact that I'm going to express my disappointment that Ohio had to be absolute fucking last in line again in social progress and change. Um, in accepting a no-duh, fucking common sense sort of thing like marriage equality. <laughs> and it, it's the sort of thing like you, you shouldn't even need to have to go to the, the Supreme Court to make that decision. That, that should be fucking obvious to anyone who objectively reads the Constitution. And it's not that hard to find. You can find it online. It's not this cryptic thing, okay? Equality for all means equality for all. And if it wasn't clear in the specific constitution, it was made explicitly clear in at least three different amendments that have been added to the constitution since. So, seriously... It took us 230 some odd years for us to realize same-sex couples have the same rights as heterosexual couples. Really? It took us this long? It took us this long? I mean, I understand that it took us almost 200 years to realize that black people had rights. I mean, oh my god, you know, people with a darker skin color than me have rights. Wow, you would think that would be common sense, obvious bullshit, but... Not in America. Uh, not in a lot of places in the world, but definitely not in America. And we're supposed to be this great shining beacon on the hill. I don't, I don't need a law degree to be able to come to the same conclusion that five out of the nine justices. And that's the thing. It was only five because there are four idiots, four fucking idiots on the Supreme Court that cannot separate the objective language of the Constitution from their sky cake bullshit beliefs. Human rights are common sense. You don't need a religion, you don't need a God, you don't even really need a law to know this. Okay? That survival of the fittest is not how we as humans have survived and thrived to become the dominant species on the planet. We have defied the laws of nature because of our higher intellect, because of our higher brain functions, because we realize that if we work together and we preserve even the weakest and the least fit of our kind and procreate, we will dominate, we will rule, we will find ways to overcome. I, the gay marriage should not even be a term. Same-sex marriage should not even be a term. It should just be marriage. And it should have been for the entire span of my life and even before that. Stonewall should have never fucking happened. Fucking slavery should have never fucking happened, okay? We had to take, you know, 230 years to learn that black people had rights and gay people had rights and, tra and transgender people have rights. We still haven't gotten that far. Okay, look, we live in a society where we've been to the moon, we can control our procreation, we can, you know, we've cured polio, we may cure AIDS and cancer, we're a lot, hell of a lot closer to it than we would have been in the fucking black ages, you know, and it's like, you want to pray to your God, go ahead, pray to your fucking God, whatever, you want to, you want to live in the fucking past, go ahead, okay, the rest of us want to move on, to the future, you know, the, the, the future where, like, you know, uh, everything is awesome and war is kind of like this thing we don't even think about. Even. Oh, war. That, that was something that, like, you know, cavemen used to do, you know. And, you know, we, we don't have to worry about, like, you know, we, we'll, we'll have animal rights because we don't we won't have to eat animals anymore to be able to sustain ourselves because we found ways to, like, you know, synthesize food that's, like, better for us because, you know, hey, we actually believe in science, and science is a good thing. Instead of this superstitious fear of, oh, robot apocalypse, zombie apocalypse, oh god, we're playing god, you know, we are gods, okay, just...
consider this. We, as a people, as a species, told nature to go fuck itself. And we became the dominant species. That is objective truth. And here we are, in 2015, still acting like fucking cavemen.